Today, we're gonna to have a look at part two of our cold steel polypropylene series. We're gonna kick it off with some training knives and tomahawks. All right, so first off, we're gonna take a look at the Recon Tanto training knife. Now, this is a great training aid for anyone doing martial arts, military drills, cosplay, anyone that needs something to look like a knife, basically. The great thing about these training knives is the fact that they are made out of the polypropylene. So even if you are using them in training, it's nice to know there is a little bit of flex. It is still realistic, but no one's really gonna get hurt while training with these knives. Now, one of the great features of these training knives is they're replicas of models that Cold Steel have in their range of tactical knives, outdoor knives. So if you did wanna train with these knives, it's nice to know you can step into the live bladed version if need be, checkered grip. So in the heat of training, when your hands are all sweaty, you're not gonna lose grip of this knife. What's great with these knives is if you do cap a jab, you're gonna know you've been jabbed, but it's not gonna hurt you. It's just gonna keep you on the ball that next time you need to block that knife. All right, next, let's have a look at something a bit different from their training series. This is their spearhead trainer. This is a newer product to the range. We're getting a lot of guys that are doing spear hunting and, and things like that with spears. So to have a training aid training version is quite handy. You can mount this to a broom handle. It's got a nice big ball on the end of the spear. So if you accidentally thrust this into your mate, <laughs> it's not gonna hurt too much. So what's good with these spearhead trainers is if you're wanting to get younger members of your family into, you wanna pass on skills for spear hunting, this is a great training option to get them learning how to thrust with the spear or to actually how to throw the spear without using a live bladed tool. Next, we're gonna take a look at the Laredo trainer. Now, this is a big, big Bowie knife. We sell a lot to martial arts guys, looking for something a little bit bigger. Safety features include a nice blunt tip as well. Nice feature of this model is you can get this in the live bladed version. So you can buy a traditional Bowie knife in the carbon steel, but you can also get your training knife. So if you did want to practice with said knife, it's not gonna be the same weight, but basically the dimensions are very, very similar for this knife. Yeah. All right, next, let's have a look at the Trench Hawk Trainer. So this is modeled off a live version that they do called their Trench Hawk. It's a design that's been in the range for many years now for those guys that are starting to get into martial arts training using Tomahawks. It's definitely something more we're popular. seeing, yeah, yeah, a lot more popular these days. These guys are starting to verge into these different styles of training weapons, whether it be a, a spearhead trainer, the knife, tomahawks so this is virtually the same size as their trench hawk trainer but being they are the polypropylene plastic they're not quite as heavy as the real thing this is molded out of one piece of material so this is going to be incredibly strong and fun to use all right guys so this is where it gets exciting first we're going to have a look at the wakazashi boken now this is a great modern take on a traditional boken now traditionally bokens are made out of bamboo and they are prone to cracking and splitting with the polypropylene construction. It's very tough and almost unbreakable. Some of the features, they injection mold this handle to make it look like it's got the ray skin and the cord wrap on it. It looks very traditional and it is true to form being that nice curve in the sword with that single hand for, for the Wakazashi wield. This is a great tool to train with guys. Be sure to get a lot of enjoyment out of it. Very hard wearing too. These things are gonna last you a lifetime. Flipping over to the Western side of stuff. So this is your medieval training sword. So it is a one-handed training sword. As mentioned before with the, the Bokkens, these do also have a hand guard that slides down over that can give you a bit of protection. So if you're grappling with this sword, you've got your hand guard there for blocking and bits and pieces like that. It does have a nice traditional look to it and feel this actually looks like a traditional sword from that era. We sell a lot of these to customers doing cosplay, medieval reenacting. They'll paint a bit of silver on here to make it look a lot more realistic, but then they can get out and have their sword fights as opposed to using a real metal sword. Now, the last sword we're gonna have a look at is the Katana Bokken. Now, this is pretty much exactly the same as the Wakazashi Bokken. Only difference is the blade's a little bit longer and the handle's a little bit longer as well. So when you're training, if you do need a longer sword, you can have that two-handed grip and you do have that longer blade. Whether you're a martial arts guy, into cosplay, I'm sure one of these awesome pieces of kit will sure suit your needs. If you'd like to purchase one of these training products or walking sticks, go to the website at xtac.com.au. You can click the link below in the description, pop down to our showroom on the Gold Coast and check these things out in person. 